Okay. Good morning to everybody, to everyone, to my students in entrepreneurship. So we will go through the week three, module three of our uh, module, uh, recognize a potential market. So we uh, already have discussed the week one, and then week two of our module, wherein you observe the importance of having a market, the, the communities, help of the communities for an entrepreneur, and the entrepreneur is also helping communities. And at the same time, the different qualities of entrepreneurs in order for him to succeed in business. So those are the things we have discussed in modules one and two, and then uh, adding the business plan guide okay, in module two. Uh, but we will also discuss that uh, along the way uh, before the end of first quarter. So we will use the created business plan, your, your created business plan, and we will fill all those information as we go on with the different modules up to uh, week nine, okay, the end of the first quarter. Now, I will show you the screen okay, for, for us to discuss the module. Entrepreneurship module, module three, weekly of first quarter. So recognize a potential market. So in order for you to become successful as an entrepreneur, you have to recognize a potential market. Because if no one will buy your product, you will not have a customer. And customer is also considered as market. Okay, so what are the things we need to know about the market? Okay, we have the learning competencies here, and in Tagalog, mga kasanayang pagkatuto. Okay, and then the different objectives that we will uh, uh, achieve. Okay, we want to achieve after okay, identifying the different items in this module. So first one, know how to identify market problem. So what are the things you need to know uh, in order for, okay, to, to see the problem and we'll do things about that. Be familiar with PESTLE, okay, so PESTLE is uh, as we, we all know, okay, this is uh, uh, one way in order for us to know uh, the potential market. Okay, so we will discuss that later on as we go on with the module. Identify potential market through trends in opportunity seeking. So what are the different trends in order for you to have knowledge or in order for you to uh, know, okay, uh, have an input about the different needs of market. Okay, and that will be an opportunity for an entrepreneur. And you base that in the, the locality and of course within Philippines. Okay, and then let's recall, provide the missing letters inside the box that describes the picture above it. Okay, so what does the picture mean? So you have to fill the information here. Okay, and then another one. So two words that describes this one. Okay, so I will leave those informations to you to answer. <laughs> okay, so let's understand oh, pag arala natin. Okay, so what are the things we need to understand? In identifying a market problem, an entrepreneur can make ways to discover existing problems, and one of which is through observation. So, you, okay, you can observe, you can watch TV, what is the different trend? 
and then you have your parents that is always going outside what are the things they they have observed the needs of the the persons or people in your locality and other things you can observe what is happening in this locality and check for any difficulties gaps improvements scarcities limitation and many others so those are the considered problems that the, 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 the community is facing so you, you can um you think for things that can solve that problem okay one of the common problems as we all know during covid 19 pandemic is the limitation in going out during lockdown and quarantine so one of the common problems as we all know especially students are not allowed to go out okay through observation market problem is very visible okay uh okay so as we can see in the picture okay observation okay just like a detective and then another way Another way that an entrepreneur can do is asking or making an interview with knowledgeable person or business-oriented person. So you can make an interview. So uh, if you know somebody who is successful, well, have, have time to, to make an interview to ask them what do they do in order for them to become successful. What is their secret ingredients? ingredients. Okay. Because of um, okay, them, experiences and knowledge in business, they can easily identify existing market problems. They can also share the problems that are that they are facing okay in all business sometimes okay uh, there are problems that uh, is frequently occurring frequently happening and those will be the challenges of an entrepreneur or businessman so entrepreneurs can have the opportunity to solve these problems okay of course of an entrepreneur is affected by his skills and knowledge as we have discussed in module two week two but this will serve as a challenge or a chance for improvement so you have difficulties in communicating communication speaking the customer is a foreigner so that will help you will challenge you to to overcome those challenges so practice speak english and then of course uh, other ways in order for you to succeed for that challenge and improvement so according to greg learning 2016 there are essential elements in identifying problems and these are first identify yourself as a problem solver yourself recognize problems okay, as you go on you can see that there are problems select in intuitive, intuitive approach and select a systematic approach okay a screenshot as part of the video about the topic is shown below so this is the screenshot but if you are using printed maybe uh, this will not be okay, readable but but of course we have the visual you, you can see what is in the picture so you have to identify yourself as a, as a problem solver you have the skill okay you know that uh, things that can solve the problem okay and then recognize problem so as you can see they have difficulties so th there is a problem in the process okay and of course after interviewing 
uh, they, they said that they are encountering problems. So that's the time you can also think of a particular solution to that problem. Maybe a business, okay, a business that can be used to solve the problem of uh, the, the person you have interviewed. So that can mean business, an opportunity. Then select an intuitive approach. Uh, sometimes you, you have to uh, think of uh, a thing. Okay, possible it will happen. Select a systematic approach. And we can, the explanation of this uh, a picture came from uh, the internet. Is on other another page. Okay, so to better explain the application of essential elements in identifying market problems, from Greg Learning 2016, based on locality, we can see that identifying yourself as a problem solver is very important in becoming an entrepreneur. Okay, yourself, as we have discussed in modules one and two for common competencies of an entrepreneur. The second element, recognizing, can also apply in every business since there is no perfect business. Okay, all of them have problems. But if we can provide solutions, that will be better. Okay, and all are having different levels of difficulties. These difficulties are just ways to have improvement and for entrepreneurs, it can be an opportunity to provide solutions to this problem. See, <laughs> they have the problem and you will be providing solutions to the problem. For example, a big, very big business, manufacturing business, they have problem. And you have the skill, you have the capacity to solve the problem. So your business or you can start your business to provide solutions to manufacturing business if you can do that that will mean business for entrepreneur okay these difficulties are just ways to have improved and for entrepreneurs it can be an opportunity to provide solutions to these problems in the third element select initiative approach it's also very essential for entrepreneurs in identifying problems. Because of experience, one can easily feel that something can be an opportunity or something big will happen and will affect positively in business. And the last element, select systematic approach, is being done through research and valuable data in identifying market problems. Okay, I think in the next chapter, okay, uh, next week, module four, uh, the, okay, it will be discussed. We're in uh, the need for a research, okay, simple research for an entrepreneur. This will help you to decide, okay, what are the things you will use in order to solve the problem. Then you can also make use of that research, okay, questions to the uh, the customers or market. You can also use that as your basis uh, for a particular business that you will start. Okay, there are trends for opportunity seeking. So let us also know the different trends. So, uh, there are ways in order for you to see the different problems in the community. And then another one is to see the trend. Okay, you can see the trend uh, that is uh, what is be always being done, the trend always wanted to have by the market, okay, by the customer. These are trends for opportunity seeking from Morato 2016, which can also be a basis for searching for opportunity or identifying market problems needed to be solved. As what we have discussed earlier, Morato itemized the different trends to market environment 
industry, market, micro market, and customer. Okay, Morato 2020, which is itemized and applied in locality. You know, so hey, okay, this is a created uh, is able to 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 uh, specify the different trends of opportunity seeking from Morato. Okay, the book of Morato 2020. Okay, macro macro environment industry market micro market and consumer so what are these different factors so for macro environment concerns with the bigger aspect of business macro micro macro bigger includes determination on political economic technological uh, social, technological, legal, and environment. So that is the meaning of PESLE. As cited by PESLE analysis contributor 2015. So, okay. Some applications of political aspect that affects business positively in financial support of the government to small businessmen. Reduction of tax, provincial program by the government and to lessen concentration of COVID-19 cases in national capital region. So those are the things being done by the government in order to make ways or to solve to lessen the problems caused by COVID-19. Okay, for economic aspect, an entrepreneur can consider the product or service that is more demanded by customer. Thus, will lead to increase in sales or service. Okay. So, increase in sales or service, but uh, now, uh, since we are uh, encountering difficulties, we, this can help uh, the businesses to survive. For social aspect, we can consider starting business to just with a new normal, the increase in delivery option of the business that dine in to lessen close contact with other people will lessen the increase of COVID-19 cases. Technological applications are the use of internet platforms in business and other innovations and then legal can be uh, a law that directly affects the business like by any and act 2020 so uh, these are the different aspects in PESLE okay this law is positive for business like money transfer, business due to uh, limited transportation, and money support for relatives being sent through this type of business. So, okay, so what happened? During the, the problem of pandemic, so we are not allowed to, to travel. So what can we do in order for us to help our love lives? Okay, uh, Okay, our relatives in other location so by using uh, this mode of uh, giving money okay so as we have mentioned while ago this money transfer business okay uh, were being used so the those type of business can okay, improve because uh, the community needs them okay and environment also refers to things to consider in business that are inclined to be environmental friendly like less plastic and the use of organic materials because many people are becoming concerned with the environment due to climate change okay so those are the changes happening in macro environment so more and more persons, people are concerned with the environment. So 
the, the business will also consider things uh, to limit okay, the, the use of plastic in the environment. And another way is industry. This is smaller than macro market, but second to the least in the trends of opportunity seeking. The National Capital Region and Calabar Zone on Laguna and Batangas have different areas under Philippine Economic Zones. We also have this in uh, okay, Taguig, okay, PESA Zone, that are helping not only the government but also creating jobs for community. So those uh, okay, that can be found in those special economic zones are manufacturing companies. Okay, manufacturing companies. So the, the customers is not only here in the Philippines, and most of their products are transported in other countries by right? the use of plane, ships, okay, and other modes of transportation in going to other countries. So they are doing it here in the Philippines. They are okay, uh, hiring the, the uh, Filipinos in order for those products to be created. So they, they are creating jobs for the opportunity. And of course, local suppliers will, are also benefited from them. So you, if you want to start a business and you want to target okay, the manufacturing or the industry, it can also be a good business. Okay. They are the customers of local companies and contractors. And then another one is market. A market is any place where makers, distributors, or retailers sell and customers buy. Examples include shops, high streets, or websites. The term may also refer to a whole group of buyers for a good or service. According to Market Business News 2020, an entrepreneur can start business and join in markets, but should always consider competitive, competitive price and quality product. Okay, so uh, the common market. So, but you have to consider the price as one of determining factors okay in the market and quality of product then micro market is smaller than market but still can be a source of opportunity to small entrepreneurs so market you are targeting a particular area uh, subdivision okay a certain place community and you will start your business uh, you can you observe that only few is having this type of business. So that will be one of the, the things that uh, you can start okay, uh, a business in that locality or in that area. Okay, then consumers, they are the buyers of product in retail and for household use. They can buy using online platforms and other ways of buying products. Physical boundaries now are minimized because of this new way of marketing and can be opportunity for entrepreneurs. So as we have no okay, you can just click in the internet, okay, you can see using Facebook, and you can deliver okay, they can order and you can deliver that okay your products to your business. So if your products are, for example, dress making, dress, uh, bread and pastry, bread or cakes, and then automotive, for example, parts of cars, what else? Okay, automotive, Prada, and then okay, okay. And of course, the different business initiated by uh, your section, Humes. Okay, because Zoom is also included uh, okay, in, in the subjects I am handling. Okay, so those are the different aspects. Now, if you will uh, check the Let's Apply 
So these are the different questions and you will just answer it by A, B, C, D. Okay, so the different approach. So these are the conditions. Okay, so you can go back to the aspect that we have discussed a while ago. Okay, uh, you, uh, the situation, okay, yourself as a problem solver it can be uh, ways to recognize problems. So you can answer it here. Then another activity, make an interview with the head of a family because you are not allowed to go out now or persons assigned in your family to buy outside your house both possible business problems to observe. So if you're not allowed to go out though, the persons at least going out in your family, you can make an interview to them, uh, okay, needed to improve in your locality. So ask them what are the different um, problems they, they have observed outside. Or you can also make use of the television. <laughs> okay. Okay. So you have to focus in your locality. So one, two, three, four. And then on areas under quarantine, if the family is not present, you can also <clears throat> do radio search, radio, uh, search radio and TV inputs for activity two. And let's apply. So, bukin natin, situation analysis. So, during difficult times of pandemic COVID-19, this is the scenario. Okay? So, will you, what will you recommend if you are in the same position? Okay? So, you can make use of this situation. Okay, uh, we can read it. This family is composed of his wife, two siblings, and Pedro can drive a tricycle. Own, owns one. What will be the trends in opportunity be seeking? Okay, will you recommend if you are in the same position? Okay, so Pedro will start a business. But uh, in, in this scenario, we can also make use of your created idea in modules one and modules two, created idea on how um, you can have your business. Okay, so it's either you will use the situation or you can apply what is your idea in modules one and two, okay? Your idea in business. So what business are you going to start? So you can make use of this uh, scenario. You can also make use of your uh, created business. So recommended trend, reason for recommending, and possible support, okay? So this is more on creative. And then let's try and then evaluation. So these questions are directly based from what we have discussed a while ago. Okay, so you can easily answer this. And okay, I think that is the last part. Okay. So Let's go back to the contents of the business plan. What are the things you can put in the contents of your business plan? Okay, the, the business plan will be created by you individually. So you will create your own business, your own business idea. Okay, so company profile, Executive summary, objectives, vision and mission. Okay. Along the way, we will discuss this. Uh, business objectives. Okay, and then vision and mission. Um, 
you you already have you created an idea in modules one and two so i will explain this uh, further about vision and mission later on industry analysis and uh, market analysis so so here are the different factors we have discussed so about socio economic demographic and other characteristics okay, market needs so what are the things did you observe okay I have an interview to uh, the father okay the the head of the family about market needs they observe in your locality so key success factor okay so along the way we will discuss this key success factors so factors that will possibly make your business successful marketing strategy and implementation so now you, you can uh, okay this is your guide huh? this is your guide in how to create a business plan so you already have okay you, you are thinking about market problems for chapter three and then strategy and implementation so that will be on chapter okay uh, week four okay marketing strategy and implementation sorry the SWOT analysis okay week four uh, marketing strategy week five I think SWOT analysis okay strength weaknesses opportunities and threat uh, modules three and four methodology then market research okay is on module four situation analysis area description organizational structure so we will discuss this uh, in the later uh, okay, topics the legal form management controls daily operations uh, you will implement this in the second quarter the da daily operations but we will uh, meet and okay uh, we will complete this as we go on with the different modules location and facilities okay and then financial analysis capital expenditures so this will be discussed in modules 5 and then administrative operating expenses financial projection sensitivity analysis financial report okay and uh, this will be on the second quarter okay Th this is are your guide so you can also make use of this one as your guide uh, the business plan concept paper Okay, make use of the logo you if you created the logo in modules one you can also put it here target date of business plan app accomplishment okay so that's this one so you will not finish this today okay as we go on i will make a follow-up is where are you already in this guide okay 